Hey everyone, I have a super fast stuffing this time because I don't have a lot of funds. I'm limited this time, but I do have a couple of things that I'm gonna switch up. So I have only $360 this time to stuff. Let's get into it. 1, 2, 3, 20, 40, 50, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60. I have 360. So let's check out what I have in my wallet. So I've got my little spring wallet here. I got guests, had it for a little bit. I'm not gonna show my info, but um, keep my little minis in here. But they're just falling apart so, 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 so bad. Um, so I'm gonna end up switching this these out. Let's see how much I have left though something what was it 60 65 that I put in I believe for gas and I have left 10 11 12 13 14 dollars that's all I have left I'm tapped out so what I do is just with the overage I'm just going to put it in here with the rest of the bills that I have left over at the quarterly I'm just gonna tuck it in there and leave it there for safekeeping next quarter and figure out what I'm going to do with it at that point. Um, so what I'm going to do with these now is I'm just going to end up getting rid of those and I made the standard long ones. So you can't really see them because it has like a holographic but it's see-through. I don't know I like it it's really 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 just clean. Okay so these are the envelopes that I ended up making super clean. So I've got for my car i'm gonna have play money beauty and i'm considering this my me envelope because i'm a beauty right we all have to think of ourselves that way so yeah instead of having having a beauty and a me envelope i'm just gonna have beauty bless you know who i really like to bless i really like giving to the kids that are hustling and doing their little hustle for their sports or their chocolates I, I just love doing that those chocolate bars are getting expensive though like I really gotta say for that and then um, I got my spend category so that'll be for if I have some money in other envelopes and I'm gonna go actually purchase the item let's say for a garden and let's say I want to buy like a tomato plant or something or a pot or whatever a water hose and i'll just throw it in there so i'll have somewhere to put it and then this is my yeah you guys should know what that is right <laughs> this is gonna be my o-ish envelope my i don't want to say 911 because most likely it's not going to be an emergency most likely it's just something <laughs> something else that I really don't need um, like an extra book for a coffee or something all right but I do have a situation now where I am going to need to overstuff this this car envelope all right so we have our $360 um, let me bust out with what I'm going to stuff in here first. I don't have a lot to stuff, but um, I am going to go ahead and put my 20 bucks in for gas. So I'm gonna put it in the car. And this is where I have like a little situation. So my car started stopping whenever I would brake or end up going really, really slow, like lowering the speed while I'm driving and it just stops, like the engine cuts off, it just totally stops. So it's now in the shop. I don't know how much it's gonna cost me, but as of right now, they are talking just to check it out. It's like 400 something dollars. So I have two envelopes in here that I kind of over, you know, stuffed and was kind of prepping for in case of anything. So I've got my car, which would go for, you know, insurance, tax, new wheels, maintenance, and I'm gonna have to pull out of here. So 
Um, I should be having to pick it up within the next few days. So I'm going to just go ahead and withdraw what I have in here and just be ready for it. Um, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight hundred dollars in car. So besides the twenty dollars in gas, I'm gonna put in the eight hundred dollars. Hopefully, it does not come out to a lot, and hopefully, it can get fixed because I cannot uh, be driving around with my three and my five year old in the car, and we get stuck somewhere. It's already painful sometimes. I'm just going around the block, so. I, I definitely don't want that to happen to us, um, especially if we're far. So that's gonna go into car. Um, for my play money, I'm going to go ahead and put in this $10. So even though we don't have a lot, I'm gonna put something in there so we can have fun. Like I said, ice creams, elote man, I don't know, who knows. But we're gonna put that in play money. For me, I'm going to put in $10. So I've got five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Being that I'm stuck without a car for the next few days, hopefully I have stuff left in here because it would be nice to have a little bit more left over every time. Um, for bless, you know what? I'm going to take out of me and I'm going to take out the five, three, four four, five. So I'm gonna leave myself with five and I'm gonna put the other half in bless because we need to do that. Definitely have that ready to go. And spend, so we're not going to go shopping. We're not gonna do anything. I'm not putting anything in there. Um, and for my emergency funds, my Oh, ish funds we're gonna put in 20 bucks have that just in case so that's that those are those envelopes however <laughs> I have the regular envelopes which I have $300 left sitting over there and as much as I want to put in for my daughter and my son, I have goal this year that I'm trying to reach and I have to get to that $10,000 for the year. I started it this year, 2021, and I broke it down $27.40 a day. Um, every two weeks I would throw in the exact amount. I added in what we got from um, tax return and try to break it even. So now I'm down to stuffing it every two weeks, $300. And that is what we have here. $300 left to go into our goal getter. I do have an awesome, awesome new update though for this envelope. I have asked Plan with Layla to custom make me my new goal getter look at that baby that's my new gold getter envelope yes because i want to be swimming in the funds just like scrooge mcduck because yes i am trying to swim in money like that so that i can be debt free <laughs> financial have financial freedom i want my paycheck to be a straight play check just like this man here um so <laughs> this duck here i should say so let me go ahead and add this in and to date, we now have one, two, three, four thousand. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So four thousand nine hundred. So okay, I'm going to end up updating my little wannabe tracker here with the dates because I didn't add it in last time, and I'm going to um, put it in for this time. So I have the four thousand nine. Let me pop that in there. So we're not gonna be giving a Costco. We're not gonna be um, putting anything in clothes. We did, however, spend um, in here. We were able to find my daughter's little windbreaker. So let me take this off. And basically two sizes up because that's how we do. As long as it doesn't look too clownish, I am totally okay with her having super oversized, not super oversized, but a little oversized so she can grow into because um, kids clothes is 
psh, about the same price, if not more, sometimes of adult clothes. So we need to uh, make that go far. We need to make it go far. So what we have left in here now is we have $30 and the gift card we used that gift card. I don't even know what's left on there, but um, maybe I'll do a little tracker on here so I can keep tab and we can know what's up in there. And yeah, garden's not getting anything. Home, home, home. We ended up taking out of home, that's right. So I only have $5 left. So I had some cash in here, but we ended up having to finish our electrical and I made myself a little, not necessarily a tracker, a monetary tracker, but it's more like a to-do list tracker. So on here, if you can see, I have some items that I have marked off. Uh, we did our carpet cleaning, we had a tub reseal, and now I have to go in and check electrical because that is officially done. Um, we have an inspector coming. I'm gonna mark that off as done. And the rest are things that I want to save up for so that we can do. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put that back in here. It kind of helps me remember what it is I'm saving for because if I don't know, I might push it back. All right, so grandma isn't getting anything. Chores isn't getting anything. So this is my blessing. So I was keeping it here, but we have money in here, which I'm going to put over in the one that I carry one, two, three, four dollars. And I'm going to get rid of that envelope. And let me go ahead and get my blessings. So it's this one right here. I'm going to add it to what I just added in. That's the bless. All right. So we've got now one, two, three, four, five, six seven, eight, nine dollars. Okay, so I can carry that around. Because I came across two situations and I was like, where's my bless, where's my blessing envelope? And I didn't have it. And I was just mad at myself for being such a big dummy <laughs> leaving it home. Okay, and next is our new envelope for vacations. Isn't she so cute? Plan with Layla does amazing amazing envelopes and i love it so much brings out the little kid inside of me yes it does but yeah that's gonna be my vacations folder so gonna work on that and check that one out isn't he great what christmas i'm not trying to be a grinch but i couldn't help it that was awesome so i'm gonna move the funds that i have in here which is $100, and I'm gonna put it in here, only because I am now going to start carrying my Christmas money. So I'm doing, I'm, I, I am gonna still keep this one in here, as per usual, but the difference is that I'm actually going to start keeping my eye open for Christmas stuff, because I find it hard for myself to actually shop during christmas time and i feel like right now we are in may and i have a few months and i can slowly but surely get something that will be meaningful that i really really want to get them not something that is left over or that you know what i'm saying like i just i just want to make sure that it's on point so i'm going to start carrying the um, hundred bucks soon. I'm gonna put it, move it to this envelope, which I don't carry the majority of the times. Every once in a while I do, um, but I usually don't, but at least that way I'll have easy access. If I know I'm running to somewhere, I can just grab the money out and put it in my spend folder and then know that that's what I'm, I'm gonna be looking out for because I know I'm going to certain stores. Okay, so miscellaneous isn't getting anything. My luxury is not getting anything. Neither are the rest of these. Womp, womp, womp. So that basically finishes up all of my cash envelopes. And I'm still working on it. I'm going to try to get them separated and in the correct order that I need them in. But as for now, that is my bi-weekly cash stuffing. 
and we gotta say adios amigos to these guys because they were just falling apart i do like the mini envelopes so i'm gonna be keeping my eyes peeled for some really good ones that'll fit inside of my little wallet there so yeah thank you guys for watching bye bye